racism debate. He has taken issue with the F.W. de Klerk Foundation. In a recent statement, the foundation says an analysis of social media messages shows that by far the most dangerous racism comes from disaffected black South Africans. The ANC's provincial 104th anniversary celebrations, entertainment and speeches the order of the day. Racism, a topical issue, and a swipe at the F.W. de Klerk Foundation, which has submitted a complaint to the Human Rights Commission regarding 45 social media postings it says incite extreme violence against white South Africans. Zikalala says the Freedom Charter is the only document that can help eradicate racism. He himself is the product of the apartheid government. He was produced by the apartheid defense force as a Benzabuyo Jele propagandist. The, the, the recent wave of the racist attack against us and the people of the country remind us as the movement that we have to double our effort. In response, the foundation says there wouldn't be a functioning constitutional democracy if it wasn't for people like de Klerk and Nelson Mandela. Regarding social media postings, it says it's unacceptable for anyone from any race group to call for people to be killed. Meanwhile, the ANC Youth League called on government to bridge the gap between former white and black schools. As young people of KwaZulu Natal who are very much concerned about metric result, these metric results serve as a proof that the white minority privilege continues to exist in our country. We think that more needs to be done to improve performance of matriculants. Meanwhile, ANC Alliance partners, the SACP, COSATU and SANCO, call for unity ahead of this year's municipal elections. Now back to that award that Balegambete received just